Hello students, welcome to my channel Easy Easy Maths. Let us start factorization. Exercise 13a, Concise Mathematics, 8th class. 15x plus 5. The first step in factorization is taking out the common factor. Here this is 5 into 3 into x plus 5. In these two terms, 5 is common. So we have to Take it out 5 and what remains is 3x plus 1. In these three terms a is common. So if we take it out here a squared remains, here a remains, here only 1 remains. In this problem 3x squared is common. So if we take it out then here 1 remains and here 2 and x. If you take the factors, this is 5 into 3 into x raised to the power of 4 y cube. Minus this is 5 into 4 x cube y. Here 5 is common. Here it is x raised to the power of 4 and here it is x cube. Therefore, x cube is common. And here it is y cube and here only y. Therefore, y is common. Let us take the common out. 5 x cube y. What remains is 3 x y square. Minus 5 has gone out. So 4 remains, x cube has gone out and y has gone out. That's all. In this problem, 17 a raised to the power of 6, b raised to the power of 8, minus 34 a raised to the power of 4, b raised to the power of 6, plus 51 a square into b raised to the power of 4. This is 17 into 2. This is 17 into 3. Let us take the common 17 first. Then here it is a raised to the power of 6, a raised to the power of 4 and a square. So the highest common factor is what? a square. Let us take it out. Then b raised to the power of 8, b raised to the power of 6 and b raised to the power of 4. Out of these, b raised to the power of 4 is common. Now what remains is a raised to the power of 4 because a square has gone out b raised to the power of 4 b raised to the power of 4 has gone out minus this is 17 into 2 17 has gone out so 2 remains a raised to the power of 2 and b raised to the power of 2 that is b square plus 17 into 3 17 has gone out therefore it is 3 a squared has gone out b raised to the power of 4 has gone out only 3 remains here Here 3 is common. This is 3 into 9, 3 into 4. First, let us take 3. And here, x cube is common. y, y squared, y cube. y is common. So what remains is, x raised to the power of 2, that is x square. y has gone out. And here, 9 remains, x cube has gone out, only x remains, y has gone out, y remains, plus 3 4s are 12, 3 has gone out, so 4 remains, x cube has gone out, and y has gone out, so y squared remains. In these three terms, a minus b is common. So let us take it out. A minus B. What remains is here x square minus y square and plus z square. Here 3 is common. 3 A, A square and A cube. So A is common. B, B square, B cube. 
B is common. C, C squared, C cube. C is common. What remains is 4, ABC has gone out, minus 3 into 2. 3 has gone out, so 2 remains. A has gone out, so A remains. B has gone out, B remains. And here C remains. Plus 3 has gone out. Here A square, B square and C square remain. Here A plus 2B is common. Let us take it out. A plus 2B. What remains is 3A plus B. A plus 2B has gone out minus A plus B. This is A plus 2B into A plus 2B. Therefore, A plus 2B has gone out. So, A plus 2B remains plus A plus 2B. When we solve this, we get three a plus b minus into plus is equal to minus a minus into plus is equal to minus b plus a plus two b. Here plus b and minus b go off minus a plus a go off three a plus two b. This is equal to a plus two b into 3a plus 2b. Here it is 6, 8 and 10. Therefore 2 is common. And in all these 3 terms a square plus b square is there. Therefore a square plus b square is common. So what remains is here 2 has gone out. So 3xy plus 4yz and minus 5xz.